In 2018 Sean Diddy Combs, the controversial music mogul, faced the unexpected loss of Kim Porter, the mother of his children. While grieving, he took extensive measures to prevent the news from reaching his kids too soon. Following his ex-girlfriend Kim Porter's unexpected death, one of Diddy's initial actions was to shield his children from the news. During their tumultuous relationship, the couple had three children together, Christian, Delilah, and Jesse Combs. Additionally, Diddy adopted Quincy Brown, Porter's son from her relationship with Albie Schur. Porter tragically passed away from a sudden case of lober pneumonia. Prior to this, she had been suffering from severe flu-like symptoms, making her feel unable to care for her children. As a result, she brought them to Diddy, entrusting the bad boy CEO to watch over them. Diddy once broke down while recalling the last words Porter said to him. Three days before she passed, she wasn't feeling well, Diddy told Essence not too long ago. She had the flu, and she sent the kids over to my house so they wouldn't get sick. One night I was checking on her, and she was like, Puffy take care of my babies. She actually said that to me before she died. Although Diddy and Porter couldn't make their relationship work, he shared that they always found common ground regarding their family. He credited Porter with providing him the tools he needed to raise their children as a single father. Every time Kim and I talked, it was about the kids. We would check in as friends, of course, but we never had a conversation that didn't include the kids. It was on some superhero. I ain't even gonna lie, Diddy said. On some level, I knew she was training me for this. I knew that I had to be ready to do whatever I was supposed to do something like this ever happened. Immediately after Porter's death, Diddy sought to honor her last words by shielding their children from the news. I jumped into mommy mode, Diddy said. I sent people in every direction to try to make sure the kids would not hear about it on social media or the news. I had to get to the girls' school and find Quincy, who was on set in Atlanta. Diddy also took extraordinary measures to ensure his son Christian, who was traveling at the time, didn't hear the news. Christian was on a plane, and I had his phone disconnected so he wouldn't read it in the air, he said. I hope you liked the video, don't forget to like share and subscribe. Any thoughts? Share in the comments and thanks for watching.